morning, here is the summer newborn to toddler bath center and shower. Like all my reviews, I'll tell you both what I like and don't like about it. First of all, the main selling point of this tub is that it can be used from infancy to toddler years with four different stages. One of the things I liked is that I could keep using it as my child was growing. The first stage is that you can put this sling in your sink for your very young baby and sponge bath or use the shower portion. However, we never used it for the infancy stage because as you can see, it doesn't fit in our sink and we didn't really feel safe putting it on the bathroom counter since the sling is actually at a slant. When we did bathe her as an infant, we just put towels on the bathroom counter and gave sponge baths until we felt she was big enough. Here in stage two, the bath sling fits easily into the toddler tub. And then, this is really cool, your toddler tub fits easily into your regular bath tub, like this. Get your new bath tub. Just like that. So we would just fill the tub to a certain amount, and then you can either sponge bath or you can use this portable shower head unit that comes with it. And it's really nice because you can actually drain it right over here really easy and then the water would just drain out right into the bathtub. Let me tell you a little bit about this shower unit. It can snap right into the tub like this. It takes actually six AA batteries which are not included. They go inside right here. The tank is pretty small since it's made to fit in the tub so as you can see it doesn't hold that much water. We usually would have to refill it about three to four times in the course of her bath. Also, the shower cord would tangle a little sometimes and make it harder to stretch to its maximum length. And my daughter constantly grabbed at it and wanted to hold it herself, which I'm sure you can imagine would get everything wet in the bathroom, including getting me soaked. <laughs> they also say you can use the shower head in stage one. However, I would not recommend that as the water can come out with a bit too much pressure for an infant in my opinion. We actually stayed in this stage until this sling stretched out. It was very taut at first and then it stretched as she got bigger and we didn't want to risk it snapping and breaking. See, it's really stretchy. So if you're planning to have a second child, it's very possible that the infant insert might not hold up for two children. After the sling stretched out, we moved to stage three, which is just the tub, the shower unit, and no sling. It was really convenient because we didn't have to worry about her being in the big tub and it was just the perfect size for her. As our daughter grew a little longer, the shower unit couldn't fit with her in the tub, so we took it out and we just used a little cup or these cute little whales to rinse her. The whales actually don't come with the tub, it's separate, separate brands. I'll put a link in the description below in case you're interested. Okay, then when your toddler outgrows this tub and can fit easily in your adult tub, then you can just use the shower portion, which is stage four. We never actually did use just the shower portion alone though, because our daughter would just continually grab at it. It was really more trouble than it was worth. It also doesn't float upright in the water, so it would keep tipping over and then the dirty bath water just gets inside it. Okay, so some other things you might like to know about this tub is that the assembly was really easy. It consisted only of attaching the sling and attaching the shower unit. It's made in the USA if that's important to you. The plastic is also BPA free. They recommend your baby be at least five pounds and not to use it over 30 pounds. However, you'll likely find that when your child gets to be more around 23 pounds, he or she will probably be too big for it already. So that was our experience with this tub in the course of time that we used it. Thank you for joining us for another one of our videos. Let me know in the comments below what bathtub you end up getting and if you have this one, how you feel about it. Hope to see you again next time. Bye!